As we've learned more about Condon tonight, we've also heard a lot of rumors. Claims about his beliefs, fake images and more. So let's go over to our Jason Puckett to verify what's real tonight. Yeah, guys, there have been a lot of rumors, a lot of talk online and in person about the suspect in this case. Let's break down what we can verify is true and false tonight. First off, we're going to address these wrong photos that keep popping up on social media. We keep having on our own social media page, these images pop up side by side and folks asking why we're showing this photo of Condit instead of this other one of him holding a gun. Well, the easy answer, this isn't Condit in the second photo. This is Sam Hyde, an internet comedian, YouTube celebrity who for some reason has become a victim of a hoax online and keeps having his photo pop up after shootings and attacks across the country. Coming back here to the board, we're firmly putting that in the false category. Second up, Kelly Kilmore. We've heard reports today that that was the name, the suspect used on the boxes he sent through FedEx. We can verify through the FBI and APD. That is true verified tonight. Next up, we want to get into a question of background checks. And some of these conversations online, like the ones you're looking at, people keep posting these pages, seeming to show that Condit was a Republican or a Democrat, how much money he made, what his life was like. We want to point out this site is false in this case. We're going to move it into the false category. Anyone can get onto this site that folks keep referencing and change the information to say whatever they want at that time. Finally, we're going to talk about white supremacy a little bit tonight. A lot of folks online have been asking if that is possibly Condit's motivation in all of this. While APD said there may be some hints possibly towards motivation at this time, we have no confirmed evidence or clues to lead us towards believing it was white supremacy or any to say that it wasn't. We're going to work on answering that, leave it unconfirmed for now. Folks, if you have any other questions going forward, any claims or rumors as this investigation continues, make sure you send them to news at KVU.com. We'll verify that information for you and get it back as soon as we can. For now here in the newsroom, I'm Jason Puckett, KVU News, Nightbeat.